What's going on everybody? Today I got my camera in from Panasonic, ordered directly from them. It's the Panasonic Lumix G85. The G85M to be more specific, it's the one with the kit lens. Um, let's see, as you see right here, boom. Reason why I got this camera over the G7 or even the GH4 is the image stabilization, 5 axis. Uh, stabilization also this kit lens is image stabilized as well also shoots 4k and it's weather sealed uh, that was mainly a big thing because uh, I was going to go for the G7 originally but I wanted the weather seal and it's a big big difference for me so it's weather seal also a little bit better quality is um was it magnesium alloy frame this camera also micro four thirds 4k video Solid all right camera has a microphone in as well. So that that was kind of like the the reasons why I ended up picking up this camera over that the G7. The GH4, I didn't pick that up yet because I knew the GH5 was coming out. But the GH5 is a totally different price bracket than this camera. So I couldn't even I I couldn't drop that cash for that camera, to be honest. Cause just the body alone for the GH5 was at around 25 and with the kit lens 35 and this is my my first mirrorless DSLR you know in that category of cameras I, I feel more comfortable with this camera than that I wouldn't don't think I would have been able to use a GH5 to its full potential this is more of a camera I know I can grow and learn and once though it'll take me a while to use the full capabilities of these cameras but anyways we're to the box right now uh you see i pulled out the lens with the hood shield right now i got the battery the charger and the micro usb that it comes with yeah here's going to be the camera right now well there's a little the next the next strap actually really nice really comfortable just this is a note it uh it says on the packaging just to charge the battery before you use it so just uh something to remember there's a charger um let me see about the battery life in this camera. Battery life is pretty decent. That was also, there we go. That was a selling point right there. The battery life with this camera is much better than the G7. That That's something I researched and I found out. So it was like, boom, sold. <laughs> that's sold. So it was uh, magnesium alloy uh, frame, uh, weather sealed, and the battery lasts longer. Those, those were the points right there that sold it that are very over and the image stabilization that make it very over the G, G7 so here's it going here's going to be there's the camera and the hand right there honestly the the feel of this camera is, feels really nice it feels quality I've played with like the cheaper cannons this is different different bracket like just the um, the knobs and the uh, and all that just feels so much better. They have a nice notchiness to them, so you know that they're in where you're putting them. So whichever selection you have, like there, it's a nice notchy feeling. It this is really quality, really quality camera that I like about it. And it's not even that size for camera. It's it kind of has a DSLR feel to it, but not as big. And also the flip on screen. There we go. So with that, you can do your autofocus and stuff. So like when you're using the viewfinder, you can also there poke around and you can select your autofocus. And there we go. There's the uh, the remote, the mic. There's your HDMI, your um, micro USB ports, little viewfinder, and it also has a pop up flash. So something less you kind of have to lug around with you. The camera comes with a 12 to 60 mil lens. But I've got some really nice shots with this camera so far. I haven't really tried any video, but I just went around like on a couple of hikes with me and I took some shots. I'll throw some up in this video here. But so far, I just like absolutely, I'm digging the camera. I love the feel of it. It's, like I said, it's my first our mirrorless, that category of camera. All right, let me talk about the selling features at this camera, which persuaded me to purchase it which was the image stabilization 
the five axis image stabilization to be uh, more correct, the post focusing features, 4K video, the weather seal, and the magnesium alloy uh, frame that you get a little higher quality. Also, the, um, the optional accessories got to add to it, the extended battery grip. So that, that was big. And also the extended battery life that you get through this camera. This camera is more efficient with the battery life. It also has a feature that will go into sleep. I think that's something different than the G7. I'm not too sure, but I also, I've done my research and I know that this camera does have a lot better battery life than the G7. All right, so I'll leave you with this last little clip I took in 4K of just a train passing by. Just a, something a little quick, just show you the little quality of it. It's not, thing, not gonna be an edit, but just the train. And I'll leave it out on that. Anyways, thanks you guys for watching. This is on a wrap that. See you next time. Shutter speed.